Hey what is for you welcome back to our channel in today's tutorial we are going to see what is ngrow how to install it in kali linux and uh, how to verify it using a token pro token provided by uh, ngrow so without any further delay let's begin this video first of all let me explain what is uh, first of all let us see what we are going to see in this video in this video we will go through this process first of all see we will, we will see what is ngrow in second step we will see we will sign up to ngrow.com it is important step because we need token uh, without that we can't use the ngrow they have to will download it uh, unzip the downloaded file move ngrow to user local slash pin because uh, it, it will help us to access ngrow from anywhere in our um, machine okay uh, they have to will go to ngrow and we will take our token and we will authenticate ngrow and they have to will see what providing in the next video okay so let us begin first of all let me explain some basic for example uh, i have written here ngrow creates a secure tunnel from your local computer to the internet this makes it easy to share your local server with others so for example you can see uh, I, I am in vs code and i have written a small html code to the login page and suppose uh, if i go live so it is my local local server and you can see its link is 127.0.0.1 and 5500 port okay so this uh, this is my lo uh, local host uh, you can clearly identify and if you try to enter this link in your computer you will get unable unable to reach because uh, you can't reach because it is my local host so what ngrok does is that it uh, provides a safe tunnel through which uh, your local server is uh, posted on the internet and anyone can access it remotely right uh, we can even share file using it so without any further delay let's uh, begin so first of all open your kali linux go to uh, firefox and but i have already downloaded it so i'll just show you how you can do it i'll go in my private window you you, you have to not go in your private window you have to just search, search over here since i have already my account is open so it will not provide me my uh, option to log in so i'm using my private window right so you have to just type here in drop login okay now the first link we get get here is uh, dashboard.ngrow.com click over here now once it is open you can see we have a login option you can enter your email if you, have, you already have account in your ngrow so you can enter your email and password and you will get login but if you don't have your account you can click on sign up for free just enter your name anything you can enter exactly anything you can enter your email and create new password for ngrow okay they have to click on create uh, sorry click on i am not robot accept the terms and condition and uh, click on sign up once you do this step uh ngrow uh, will send you email in email it will provide you a link once you click on that link it will redirect you to the page it will look something like this so now we are going to download so you can simply come down and you can see here we have three option apt download and snap we'll cl click on download and here it is written for so if you want to check that it is it's 864 architecture or not so simply click on your terminal and type here arc it will auto automatically detect but but it is just a cross checking so see it is my it it, it is my x 86 and 64 so it is okay so just click on download and it will start getting downloaded now uh, for example i have already downloaded this file so you can see uh, it is up at once complete it won't take much time so once it's uh it, it gets downloaded just i'm just let me close the tab okay and now open your terminal and let me increase its size okay once it get downloaded it will get downloaded in download folder so open downloads and let me ls so you can see uh um, uh we have a file we have to unzip it and it is a tar file you can see it uh, at last teaser teaser so we have to give command tar and it's for extraction and f for extraction file and you have to provide this file name just enter in crop and press tab it auto it will auto automatically delete okay now press enter and in Grok has been extracted now let us press ls and you can see it has been extra extracted now what we are going to do is we are going to move this in group file to our bin because uh, if you want to use in group you have to all, always come to download folder to use it and if we um, move it to bin we can use it from anywhere 
so it will be a very good uh, option to do this uh, although it is optional if you want to do you uh, I, but i will recommend you to do that so just let us move it sudo mv and mm, again uh, in block thereafter slash uh, which is root uh, user local slash bin and press enter enter your password okay now next step which we are going to do is we are going to verify our auth token so just let us move to our first path got home folder sorry directory press enter again you have to open your firefox and simply you can open uh, again open your in rock Since we have already created our account, yeah, now just we need our auth token to verify it, right? So, okay, now click on this three line, and uh, you can see under getting started, it has your auth token. Click on it, and just copy this. You can see we and in command line it has option in drop, and config add talk token. This okay, just copy it and come to your terminal and paste it okay and press enter uh, now our file has been saved uh let us check let us check it so if you press ngrok http and let me press okay press enter okay now we are online it is working so guys that's it for today's video in next video we are going to see port forwarding and uh, i hope this video was helpful for you do subscribe to our channel and give a thumbs up and give your feedback in our comment box see you in next video thank you